Hey everyone, so quick download on my progress for this week. I lost a couple of pounds, a couple of inches. Um, I've been through Fraser and Lauren's Fat Apocalypse program um, before as well from earlier this year and that's pretty much how I've been able to maintain my weight loss. And um, I've done the vegan thing for a week at a time before and that's about my max. And so at the end of that I would start craving meats again and you know I'm facing that same challenge now. It's like okay. I had those thoughts going through my mind today that, um, all right, you did the one week, you know, you got the keto down, but then I'm looking ahead of the schedule. I'm like, oh my God, there's another week of what looks like low carbs and um, no meat. And there's a, basically seven weeks ahead of that. Um, and then I saw Fraser's video this morning, the, the mindset video of the drop by drop. And if you guys haven't listened to it, I really, really encourage you guys to listen to it. It's um, It really helped me turn around my mind this morning about how I'm going to think about and view um, the next coming week and a lot of people have been hearing about this challenge of mine going oh my god eight weeks like how are you gonna go like what what the hell what the hell were you thinking this that and the other and I'm like you know everything is a mind game like even if you choose not to be vegan at the end of all this or even vegetarian um, it's it's a challenge that you're choosing to train your brain muscles in and see how how your body and your mind react to you retraining it into a new way of thinking and also one of the things I noticed this week was that just like every other time when I've had vegan only food and I don't know if you guys experience the same and if you guys do please share because I'd love to hear about it from you guys um, I start getting of course more in touch with my mind body spirit like everything but a lot of like along with like the the bad physical stuff that goes out of your body from eating cleaner and lighter loads and eating vegan um, there's a lot of emotional gunk that comes out and this week was just like highs and lows and highs and lows and um, just a lot of tears and a lot of happy you know just smiles and it, it was it was a lot it was a lot this week to process um, all at once and um, so if anyone else is going through it um, do share because it's definitely a challenge there's a lot that you um, learn about yourself um, eating this clean and eating vegan so anyway, I just wanted to share my progress. Um, I'm not ready to share my pictures quite yet, um, but I am very happy with the bit of progress that I made this week, and I'm looking forward to next week and seeing you all in the group.